morning, good morning, good morning. My name is Ebony. I am the CEO of Ebony's Mobile Notary, the founder of 757 Notary Sisters, the owner operator of Boss Events, and the new owner of She Flips. Anyway, good morning. It is the 24th of October and it's the end of the month. So we are doing end of the month earnings. What did I do with my money? How do I separate this money? I talk about it all the time, how it's so important that you are careful about your money and make sure you pay your taxes, right? So if this is your first time being here, if you come back around the end of the month, I will, I'm very transparent and I will share what my earnings are and what my money kind of looks like. Um, again, I could be spending money wrong, but I've never been so comfortable in my life. I've always said, I'm not rich. I'm not rich. I come from repossessions, evictions, bad credit, the whole nine yards. And my credit is still not all that great. Well, it's good now, but we easy with it. So um, it's just kind of hard for people to still now extend me credit because of my history, right? So that's what I'm working on more so than anything so let's not waste our time because we know y'all don't like washing ebony's mobile notary six thousand three hundred dollars is what we made for the month and remember y'all i pay myself once a month right so six thousand three hundred dollars that's what I ended up with a bunch of loan signings that I didn't think I had, and I even took a week off. But I also did a few apostilles. I did, like, it was like three back-to-back, -back, and then one client had two items. 757 Notary Sisters, of course, I started those workshops again, so that did do a lot better. So that did make $3,600, y'all. Boss Events, blew it out the window, blew it out the window. $4,720, y'all. That's with weddings, photo booths, uh, Jesus. And as y'all know, I'm a nurse. I worked one shift, $300. Brought a grand total of $14,920. Yay! Sounds amazing, right? Sounds amazing. We gotta pay taxes on that. So taxes was about $4,000 which left $10,920. We got expenses. We got expenses. And I bought a new photo booth, y'all remember. So my expenses this month were $2,800, which left me with $8,120. So with that is what I pull my owner's withdrawal from. Is from the $8,120. So now I'm working with this $8,000. What I do next is I pay all my household bills. Y'all know I just bought my daughter a new car, so I do pay that car payment for her while she's in college, even though she got a full-time job. You know, never mind. I said I was going to do it. I'm going to do it. So overall, household bills, we're talking rent, car, car insurance, lights, cable, um, those things, just the bills in the actual house. We're not talking food, gas, or anything. The house, $3,800. So now that leaves that pot of money with $4,320. I, mean, $4, I take 25% of that and I can do whatever I want with that. That's $1,080. I can blow that. I can go buy a TikTok shop. I can go buy anything I want on Amazon. That is my money that I can blow for the month. That's my money. The rest of it, $1,080 times three is divided up into all the accounts. Okay? Does that make sense? So I take... $1,080 and I divide it up into all of Ebony's mobile notary bank accounts. Y'all know I got a whole bunch of bank accounts for every single business. So out of the $1,080 that I'm gonna give back to 
Ebony's Mobile Notary. I'm gonna put some money in there for gas. I'm a, I got a gas account. I'm gonna put money in there for my oil changes. I'm gonna put money in another savings account just to save, just in case of emergency. I'm gonna put like $200 away for marketing for Ebony's Mobile Notary. I'm gonna put, I call it my Amazon savings account for my mobile notary business. So like when I need stickers and new marketing supplies, or if I wanna buy an Etsy template, that money goes there. Same thing with 757 Notary Sisters. I get the woe is me when people saying, oh, I need to renew my NNA, but I don't have the money for it. I can go look at my savings account and be like, yo, can you pay me back? Hey, somebody does owe me money. Hmm. I ain't even gonna track that girl down because God got that. Um, and then my um, other account for boss events, like if you know, last week I had to call somebody in to fix um, a piece on my photo booth that I couldn't fix. It cost me over $100 for me to call them in. I went into the Boss Events bank account, into the savings account that's over in Boss Events, and I was able to pull that money. So that is how I pay myself. So if I want to go out to eat um, for November, I got $1,080 to do it with. If I want a new outfit, and actually, baby, I'm getting ready to light up this TikTok shop real quick. I got $90 of stuff in my car. It's coming out of that $1,080. So again, I'm not rich. I'm not rich. I'm just doing something different with my money. I'm not blowing it. Like, that was a good month. I almost made $15,000 for the month within all my businesses. I don't think I've ever had numbers that high. But that doesn't mean go on vacation. That doesn't mean turn up city. That means do right by my money so that I can have that generational wealth, so that I can have longevity with my earnings, right? Hell, I tell anybody, I don't even have a sofa. I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna buy one this month because now it's just about you ain't winning look for a sofa versus you don't wanna spend the money. The money's there. Now I just need to look for one. I'm not going and getting my nails done. I'm not going and getting those $100 eyelashes like I was doing. I'm not driving a Mercedes Benz. I'm doing right by my money. And I'm going to continue to do right by this money because I see once I stop spending like I was some drug dealer, I could see my money. And I can see it. So again, recap, overall, we made $14,920 after all our bills, all our expenses, after we paid everything, paid ourselves, we got $1,080 to blow, to blow. And baby, I ain't gonna have no hard time doing it because I got this Halloween party and I had to buy this damn $100 Halloween costume because I need it here tomorrow. But it's gonna be cute. I'm gonna look so cute. I just gotta get some shoes. But things like that, like, and the only reason why I bought the outfit was because I'm renting out my photo booth. So you see how that, it came back. It's going, the money is coming back full circle. Renting out both photo booths is for a Halloween party. I was like, what am I gonna wear? That's what I'm gonna wear. So things like that. But this was definitely a good month. I definitely did very, very well on not eating now. I definitely did very, very well on managing my money. There were days that I did feel real brokey, broke, broke, and I'm missing a debit card. That doesn't help. Um, <laughs> so if I want to buy anything using that debit card, I only can buy it on my computer because I don't know the numbers to it. But I'm going to get a new one. It's okay. And that's the, another good thing about paying myself once a month is because I didn't worry about it because I only paid myself once a month. I wasn't never looking for the money that was on there. And it, that was that's the 757 car. So the money just was racking up as y'all was buying the tickets to whatever. So we at the nine minute mark. We know y'all don't like watching, but we did good $14,920 after we took out taxes, expenses, paid our bills. We had $4,320 after I paid myself that still left well over $3,000 for me to disperse throughout all of my accounts for me to actually start putting money into my new business, She Flips, where I'm going to be doing the mobile home investing and keep growing and stretching from there. 
All right, y'all. Y'all have a good one. I hope this video helps somebody. You know that I got these workshops going on. If you're trying to become a mobile notary, if you're trying to do the wedding officiant thing, if you need help with apostille, marketing, all of those things are available to you. They're all available to you. I'm just not a good salesman. That's all. I'm just not a good salesman. Like I put it up here somewhere, but I try to mention it in the group. But I'm not a good salesman, if that makes sense. But the resources are out here. They are available. Facebook group is 100% free. Etsy store, one-on-one -on -one calls. Those whole nine yards. All that stuff is available to you. So let's get it.